So it's your boy Downsize, and I'm back once again on my block with another hood classic. And this one here, I want to speak about the whole beef between Brick Baby and uh, OG Cowboy uh, from Neighborhood Rolling 60s. Um, I've spoken a bit with about this with Judson Bacot, and um, you know we both checked. Uh, the cartoon 53 video that he put out about it and um, I've personally seen uh, other content on it um, now I want to say this okay just for those who are unaware of, of the situation <laughs> there <coughs> so they've been they've been having back and forth you know what I mean about who's who in the hood, you know what I mean, um, cowboy don't seem to know him, and, you know what I mean, dude don't seem to show, whatever, and, I don't know, you know what I mean, it's, it's, it's their neighborhood, I ain't nowhere near there, but, um, I just want to speak to the politics of it, because it's public, um, okay, so, now, like I said, it's been back and forth in 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 OG Cowboy. Um, he called Brick Baby to the fade. It was they've been and they got an upcoming hood day, and so Cowboy called him to the to the uh, hood day for the fade. Brick Baby say ain't gonna be that. Yeah, you know I mean, you know, he say. He, Basically, you know what I mean? He ain't gonna do that. He ain't gonna be no fighting. You know what I mean? Which I think you know what it means. Um, he ain't doing no fighting. So, uh, I wanna say this, big baby, homie. It ain't nothing but a fade, dog. Like, honestly. It'll go a whole lot easier. It'll be a whole lot more heartfelt, honestly, if you showed up and took it. If you took it. If you went over there, pull your shirt off, and just scrap, Tommy. Just pull your shirt off, say you ain't got none, and just let, let him go. I don't know. If I had to bank on it, I'd put my money on Cowboy. <laughs> he just looked like he'd been fighting for like a long time, for like longer than both of you, both of us been alive. Like he been fighting like a long, long time, dog. Like really hard too, huh? You know what I'm saying? And you probably heard about all his squabbles in the hood and shit. You know what I mean? You probably heard all his scraps and scrapes and shit in the joint. <laughs> Cowboy looking like he, you know, he dug a fuck out a long time ago, like. Like, first, let me say this to Cowboy, man. Bro, you too old for that shit, though. Bro, for real. Like, to be even, you know, to be even getting into the type of, type of, uh, back and forth with, 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 uh, your little homies like that. I, I seen, hold on, let me refer everyone to this, man. Find find for yourself a video by Cowboy online where he checks a little homie in the hood for for Xing out whoever in the hood, right? And, and, uh, and, and check that video out. Check what he says. And it's crazy because, like, I had I had gained a lot of respect for him for that. You know what I mean? And this I believe is pre Nipsey, so you know I'm certain the whole Nipsey. Well, abs I, we absolutely know that the Nipsey uh, situation turned him sour. So, um, yeah, I get it. But bruh, come on, cowboy. That cowboy that was telling that little homie about exing exing out exing out people on the walls is 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 what you need to evolve back to, cause you digressed. 
and, and, and like, you know, that little homie, if you feel like he's wayward, then there's a whole other way of going about that. And you know that. But um, I don't know. To each his own. Because, you know, you call shots different. Everyone, everyone calls their shots different. Obviously, you know, it's more than just Cowboy and Brick Baby in the hood. It's a big you there, too. You know what I mean? Like, so, um, that being said, I mean, First and foremost, age matters most, and you' supposed to be the bigger man, brother man. For real, for real, for real. Like you have to be. I mean, but of the same token, once it gets to that point, then you know what a fade it is, right? It don't have to go to anything more than. Once it's escalated to the point for whatever reason that the such disrespect has been had, then you know a fair fight is what it is. Yeah, you know I mean, like it is what it is. Um, me myself, I'm 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 a forgiving and merciful and compassionate person, so. You know, I'm I'm of the I'm I'm of the of the mind frame that, you know, I'm quick I'm quick to forgive and I'm 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 trying to slow the anger and slow the wrath. You know what I mean? Um because it can happen in an instant, you know, when you suffer from PTSD being where we come from and the human experiences that we have in life with the treachery and, and betrayal and everything, you know? So, you know, it's on us who know better to show better. You know what I'm saying, bro? And the brick baby, though, bro, like, homie, like, from what I gather, it appears to me like, and uh, I've heard this, that the sixties kill their own. Did I mean my hood does, does it too? We have we have we have it in our hood. It's but you know sixties obviously Nipsey got it by his homie whatever, and I can get it. I see it. I understand it. Yeah, you know I mean, I come from basically the same place, only different. You feel me? Um, but brick baby, like, I get, I get, you know, you a rapper. You have a reputation to uphold. You're a rapper. Don't, don't try to, don't try to be otherwise. Like, like. Cowboy's a hood dude trying to rap. You a rapper trying to be a hood dude appears because he's there in the hood. He like there. He's always there. But you not. So so like sorry about that. So um yeah it seems that you know it serves it serves everyone's best interest. It serves everyone well, I'ma tell you, to to scrap, dog. In spite of what's been said. Like I said, take your shirt off. Take your lumps, dude. They go, dude. It, it, bro. It ain't <sighs> If you gotta kill your own kind, like that's that's the closest kid you can get to actual blood, bro. Is like a neighbor from the neighborhood, and I'm you know 
it's no pun intended in that. You know what I mean? I'm not even referencing. I'm just saying in the community, especially below the line of poverty, there's a bigger picture. You know what I mean? You want to throw your life away for what? When, you know, I get the reputation and I get the need to save face, but you go there, take a life, then what? You threw your life away. You threw your life away. It's gone. It's over. You can't, you, there's no outliving that. That's it. That's what you sent yourself to in the instant you commit that. <clears throat> and to even speak that to yourself. Well, homie, just talking about these, dog. It's crazy. It's crazy, crazy, crazy. It's like John Moran, kind of crazy, 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 bro. <laughs> For real. But, um, yeah, I mean, I just want to speak my piece on it because, like I said, me and Justin, we've been speaking a lot about it. And I think that it speaks to a lot of neighborhoods, man, because I've heard a lot of these youngsters, man, a lot of... You know, these kids in their 20s, and even 30s on the front line. <clears throat> look up, you know, those in their 20s, look to the 30s and 40s, like, where the OGs at? Where those at? Like, it's supposed to be, you know what I mean? When, you know, homies in their 20s are getting that shit from the homies in, in their 30s and so down and so forth. And it's like, you know, there's a, there's, you know, the older one is, the further one is removed from it, yet st still the greater the influence one has because of how far one is removed from it. But this is what we do to ourselves. You know what I mean? So, so, you know, what is, what is, what is being handed down to these youngsters but that? But at the same time, you know what I mean? Uh, that no gangster don't rap. It ain't a gangster they rap. Rappers rap. Yeah, I mean, gangsters don't talk about it. That ain't even. So, the rest of it, what is it? And to throw your life away for what? It's your own kind, bro. It's your own kind doing all the killing there. Peace! And I'm out.